Welcome to Andy's Creative Studio. I'm Andy, and today we are going to do something not different, but I just figured this out, and I want to share it with y'all, with everybody. And it is using y'all got paint, or you can probably buy the Apple. Apple or metallic um, paint from um, Hobby Lobby, you know, the cheap paint. You don't have to have, probably have the folk on it. As a distressor. And we are going to do this little flower, or this little um, digi, or printable. And um, I'm going to it, paste it onto, this is not really a thick card, Dark paper, but it's it's thick on it. Just so it will give it a little bit of still uh, a bit thickness. Um, I can't even talk today, so y'all just bear with me, and we'll get to it. Okay, I'm using uh, just regular liquid glue. It Whatever. And I put mine in these um, Sugar Bella, Sweet Sugar Bella uh, bottles because of the tip on my lamp. And I want to thank Pam from the Paper Outpost for that idea. I love these things. I've got these. I'm just going to trim it out, just like you normally would, and I printed this all on just uh, copy paper, because that's all I had at the moment, and hard to just to print a printable, and uh, so, well, we'll have to be doing this. I'm just going to use that as my now I'm going to take I'm, and I'm using one of these uh, sponges you can use your finger um, this is the thickness I got with my finger, and I use uh, the gold meta um, metallic paint also with this, so I kind of mixed it, as you can tell on my little deal. And um, but this came out really like more of the uh, uh, ink. If you can't, you know, if you don't can't afford the ink or just don't have access. And you got a bottle of acrylic paint, use it. Or you could use um, just um, artist paint, acrylic paint. We may have to try that next. I just kind of messed this up, but it'll be okay. But just fix it like you want it. I'm going to add a little bit of go. You know, you can do what you want to do. You don't have to do what I do by any means, but you can use your ink pads for this. Um, you can use paint. You can use chalk. You can use a um, soft pa uh, pastels with it. Okay, now I'm going to make this into a paper clippy. So I'm getting a paper clip. What color paper I need? Oh, I can use the yellow one there. And I'm going to use the back of this. I'll use this. I'm going to stick this in my on my paper, the small size inside. I'm 
Like I said, you can use any glue you, you want to. I mean, everybody's got their own favorite glue. And I'm not sponsored by nobody. No glue. Whatever my hands grab, usually. I'm not particular. Whatever my budget can afford. Um, uh, everything that I get is on my budget. So, and sometimes that's a good budget, and sometimes it's not. This month it wasn't so good with a $600 electric bill. But, it's hot here. Okay, now I'm going to go from, I'm just going to ink, ink the outside of it, and like I said, uh, paint, you, use what you got, uh, but we'll do one with chalk. Where's that? Where's that one? Let me Uh, this came from uh, KateCrafts.com and uh, Freebie. And I'm going to use one of these green deals again. Uh, tool, my finger. I'm just going to cut it back out. These scissors is Walmart. Uh, I don't they are Westcott titanium, and they. Cut if anybody's wanting to know where, where those came from, I'm going. Awful because they are older than Kingdom Come. These is um, metallic cream chalk. I don't even know if Pebbles is still in the market. Like I said, these things is as old as Jerusalem. I mean, I've had these since oh, really? I don't even know how long I've had these. 
Let me find. Um. I'm going to use, I think I'm going to use this brain. That's it. When you ink in or... Don't be afraid to play. Don't be afraid to add corn to it. I keep just keep on playing. Nothing else. Use your fingers. Oh, washable. I've always say use what you've got. Uh, yeah, I like that. I know this like clean, but it'll be okay. It's I don't think it's supposed to be that way. You know, that's how you do it in my book. Okay, so is that with that chalk, with the pebbles, uh, metallic chalk. And let's see. And let's use the, uh, basic. From the Kate, uh, KateCrafts.com, and I'm just going to put this one out. That. Okay, I'm going to get that out of my way, but just out I am going because that ain't straight and that is going to be. Yeah. 
Y'all don't believe me. Believe me. Uh, it's just bad. I am using... If I can't get straight in the class. And now I'm going to take my chalk, and I just lost it. I just had it, y'all. That little pink dilly. I'm just going to use the edge of this. And it's got a little bit of pink, so I think I'm going in with pink. Now, y'all, I am not, I like my coat. I like black. I am not, no, don't. I'm going to I mean, I found that Walmart's for hardly nothing in the office. Walmart. If you go to Walmart, um, they'll do no sales them. Mm, I don't think. I ain't seen them. Let me rephrase that. But they get more stuff each time I go, so. I mean, you can just. this uh, even the paper quilt. So there is three different ways of doing that um uh, inking without ink. Probably could use I would it because you have to use so much water. Um I ain't gonna mess with them, or I'm gonna mess up. But those three different ways of in inking without ink and um, chalk, and uh, metallic chalk, or cream chalk, and um, acrylic craft paint. And like I said, I think any of the, well, that ain't it. <laughs> any of the craft paint will want, um, this is what I had on hand. To try, and I've got tons of paints and art supplies and you know all that fun stuff. And I just use what I've got on hand. I don't try to. I mean, I had an idea. I wanted to try it. I tried it. I mean, this is all the ones I did with the paint, and this is mainly with my finger. And uh, my husband's calling. So, anyways, and all these are paper clips. So, I hope you enjoy this video. Give us a thumbs up. Subscribe to us and come back and see us. We love y'all. Bye. Have a blessed day.